Today I'm talking to you about two wonderful alternatives to Kratom. These can also help you taper off of Kratom and I definitely recommend that you give them a try, but I will say that you need to make sure you get them from reputable sources because some people mask Kratom or stem in vein or not as strong Kratom as these two different herbs. The two herbs that we are talking about today are Hirsuta and Jabnica and I'll go over each of them, kind of what they are known for and used for, and then also my favorite blend ever that helps me take a break from Kratom. I actually take it every single day in place of one of my Kratom servings and it does a beautiful job of energizing me, giving me that mood boost, and I can't wait for you guys to try it. So let's start with Hirsuta. Hirsuta is very similar to Kratom, supposedly, although I would argue that it isn't as similar as some might think. It's definitely not as strong. It doesn't have the same alkaloids. It's mostly used for immune boosting properties and you'll find that with Javanica as well. There are a lot of anecdotal stories about how it's been used for certain things, but definitely used for its immune boosting properties. And the same can be said about Jobnica. Jobnica actually looks almost identical to the Kratom plant. It has some similar alkaloids, but again, a lot of different alkaloids and it doesn't work the same. Something really important to note about these two is that they are legal everywhere, at least in the USA. I can't speak for other countries because I'm not from there. So if you do live in a state where Kratom is illegal, maybe you can check out Hirsuta and Jabnica. Think of these as like very mild forms of Kratom. They still have really great benefits and actually they boost the immune system more than Kratom does. So if you are someone that gets sick often, these might be some great herbs to add into your rotation. Now, one of my favorite ways to incorporate these is to mix half of my Kratom serving with half of either Hirsuta or Jabnica. And actually, I think the blend of Hirsuta and Jabnica make the most wonderful combination and it works really, really well. I really want to share with you my favorite blend that I take every single day and it is called Break Time by Your Leaf Your Life and you can actually save with code TQUEEN. Thank you in advance if you use this code because it does support me. This break time blend is so fantastic, you won't even realize that you're not taking your traditional Kratom. Now, break time blend has hirsuta, jamnica, and stem in vein. What people don't realize is that when they take Kratom powder, the majority of the time, you are getting just the leaf part of it. You are not getting the stem in vein part of the Kratom plant. Now, they take the stem in vein because it does have different alkaloids. It can be not as strong in certain ways, and it has a different property and feel to it. Definitely not as strong. But when it's combined with that combination of Hirsuta and Javnica, it really packs a punch and I think that it works just as well as regular Kratom. And again, this is going to help you get your tolerance down. It's going to help you with your serving sizes throughout the day. And it's definitely an energizing one. I wouldn't recommend this one before bed, but everyone's body responds differently. You can find different reset packs which have Hirsuta and Javnica in it, as well as other things like Blue Lotus to help you sleep. And these are ways that you can definitely taper down off of your Kratom or if you just want to take a tolerance break. But overall, I think Hirsuta and Javnica are one wonderful medicinal plants that not as many people know about. And again, because they are legal, I think it's something that you should definitely check out. Some reputable vendors that I really enjoy that carry Hirsuta and Javnica include Your Leaf, Your Life, and also Benny's Botanicals. Some really great stem and vein that I enjoy as well includes Your Leaf, Your Life, and Happy Hippo. Happy Hippo has some fantastic stem and vein. Again, I also think Your Leaf, Your Life has some really fantastic stem and vein. They are really great sources and definitely have the best and my most favorite stem and vein that I have tried. And remember with Happy Hippo, you can also use code QUEENS15 to save and your leaf, your life is the code TQUEEN. Again, if you use these to support me, I really, really appreciate it because I genuinely recommend these products. I've had so many people rave about them over and over and over, so I know it's not just me enjoying them. And of course, if I can get you a code to save you a little bit, and if you can use the code to help me a little bit, it really benefits both of us. So let me know in the comments below, have you ever tried Hirsuta and Javnica? Have you heard about them before? If you do give them a try, let me know, come back to this video, tell me how it's worked for you. Now, I also don't want you to go into this with the expectation that they are going to work the same as Kratom because they don't. And even Stem and Vein is very different than the traditional Kratom leaf powder that we know and, and have come to love. But I think that if you go into it with an open mind, realize that it's not going to be the exact same and you know use these as a great alternative or in addition to your kratom i think that we can find great ways to lower our tolerance and incorporate other herbs into our kratom routine thank you so much for joining me for this video today remember we are all botanical queens and i will see you soon in the next video